December marks one year since a mother of five was killed at a Pinellas County gas station. This after a vehicle struck the gas pump where she was getting gasoline, sparking a fire. And as ABC Action News reporter Julie Salamone finds out, her family filed a lawsuit nearly three months ago. And new tonight, a settlement has now been reached with some of the parties involved. Cell phone video from December 2021 captures a raging fire at a Circle K gas station on East Lake Road in Palm Harbor. Just days before Christmas, a mother of five, Cheryl Cabalis, is killed while pumping gasoline. A driver backed into the fuel dispenser, knocking it from its base, pinning Cabalis against her own vehicle. Her two children witnessed the explosion. It's beyond imagination for what Cheryl must have realized what was happening and who was watching when she was dying. Court records filed just last week show numerous photos from the deadly fire, including pump number eight engulfed in flames and the charred vehicle dispenser on Cabalas's vehicle. In August, attorneys representing Cabalas's family sued 13 defendants, including Circle K. Newly filed court records indicate the family has settled with numerous parties for an undisclosed amount, but a settlement has not yet been reached with Circle K. The lawsuit alleges the defendants destroyed multiple pieces of physical evidence, including a shear valve, a fire suppression device designed to stop all fuel flow if the pump is damaged or struck by a vehicle. The second category of evidence that was destroyed was the connective hardware, which is the bolts, nuts, and washers that were used to attach the fuel dispenser to the ground. The attorney representing Cabalas's family recently filed a motion last week asking the court to get involved to ensure the parties involved do not discard any remaining evidence for future litigation. We reached out to an attorney for Circle K but have not heard back. Julie Salmon, ABC Action News.